Johnny, you're out. Fashion is like oxygen, I guess. It's hard to be taken away from it. I'm doing this really great dress that looks like origami. Ooh. And it has origami cranes coming off the shoulder that are actually holding the dress up. I would have kept the original dress. I think the original dress would have got a better response. Even though it was sputtered on or whatever, I think I could have figured out a way to fix it. As I watched my design coming down the runway, I look at it with kind of distaste in my mouth. It felt like everything I had worked for at that moment had just been taken away. How much time did you spend on your dress? I did two of them. Why? What happened? Uh, the first one, I was ironing it, and the uh, steamer started to sputter. It got water all over it, and the whole thing was destroyed. I don't make excuses for my work. What happened is what happened. I did what I could in the time that I had left. The other dress was, was pretty, was hardcore, I have to admit. It was a red mess. <laughs> it was a red mess. Thanks, that's sweet. One of Tim's comments was that the birds attacked the dress. I think I could have done much better and gone a lot farther. But it's not how the cards played out for me. I accept that. This was a great experience, working every single day and doing big projects. And I didn't realize how much I missed it since I was in school. And I feel re-energized now. I'll definitely show Bryant Park one day. It won't be the Project Runway, but one day I will be. And I'll be where I want to be as a designer. See all the Project Runway video extras at mylifetime.com.